Mr. Beacon, I don't know one end of the camera from the other. Neither do I. So it doesn't stop me from selling them. Yeah, but you want me to go to Dresden and buy cameras from the people that make them. Now, once they give me that spiel about uh, focal lengths and... Uh... I didn't say buy. You know how it is. We want to look at specifications and prices. Send your report back to London and... Uh, then you tell me what I really want to know. Which is what? A friend told me that you were once connected with American intelligence. I was born in East Germany, Mr. McGill, in Dresden. I have a brother there, Johann, a very talented musician. Years ago, he was the youngest first violinist in the Dresden Symphony Orchestra. I want you to find him. Well, why don't you find him yourself? I cannot return to Germany. Why not? In 1953, I escaped from East Germany and Johann stayed behind. Now neither of us can climb the wall. Well, then you write to each other? He hasn't written. Not in five years. And maybe he's dead. I thought so. But last week I got a very delicately phrased message from a distant relative. The violinist is back in Dresden. And he hasn't tried to write you or contact you in any way? No. Well, where was he those five years? In prison, I think. What for? Johan was interested in politics. Which party? No, oh, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, I'm not interested in politics. Then you can understand that I don't care whether my brother is right or left or in between. He's all that remains of my family. Listen, East Germany just isn't the safest place on earth for me. Mr. McGill, I was told that you do dangerous work for money. I offer you dangerous work and I offer you money in proportion. What proportion? Name your price. <laughs> okay. I get a legitimate visa. I travel under my own name, using my own passport. I'll obey every law in the book. And if I smell the slightest aroma of trouble, baby, I'm heading home. And if I locate your brother, it's gonna cost you $20,000 plus expenses. And if I don't locate your brother, It'll cost you $20,000 plus expenses. Those are difficult terms. Do me a favor, turn me down. No, I agree. You want me pretty badly, don't you? I want my brother. Talk to you later. 